We've been playing with the Ouya game console, and many people have been asking what games are available for this sucker, and a few, I would say. In fact, we're going to go ahead and scroll through the genre list in the Discover menu, just for a quick overview to let people know that there's pretty much something for everyone. Adventure, All Ages, App, or these would be the apps, not just games, but uh, some apps that you might be able to, to run on there, including, is that, uh, okay, Twitch, Tune In. Very nice, so if you want to listen to any music while you're playing around, Blueboard, ooh, that sounds, like, fun. The app allows you to use your Android tablet or smartphone as a keyboard! Bonus! Very nice, alright? That's not really a game, though. It's, it's, it's just an app. So you can run apps, not just games, on the Ouya. We also have arcade or pinball games, love those. Card, casino games, dual stick games, fight, so, uh, fighters, uh, first-person shooters, we got a meditative genre. I had no idea that was even a genre. Platformers, uh, Cannabalt. I've, I've I've heard that game before on other other devices. So maybe they just ported this one over. Very nice. I love that there's also a genre we'll get to called short on time. Perfect for people like me, casual gamers. Love that. Uh, so we also have uh, after platformers, play with friends, puzzle trivia, racing. Retro, another one of my favorites. I have... Whoa, 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 hang on. Go back to Retro. I saw Oregon Trail. Oh, no, no, it's Oregon Trail. I, I, I grew up on Oregon Trail. Oregon Trail. I died of dysentery so many times on the Apple IIe. It's crazy. I have a uh, stand-up machine over there. It's not coin-operated, though. It's a, a, a MAME machine. It's very nice. I play all my classic games on it. We've got role-playing, or RPGs, including Final Fantasy III, for those who love that. The short on time, or the casual category, sim and strategy, sports, you know, it seems to be about it. And you might realize that some developers are still getting their devices themselves, so I would expect that by the time you watch this video, or if you watch it a year from now, the game library will have certainly expanded. If you don't want to browse by genre, you could check it, and these assumedly would be highlights. There's also staff picks. Is that how you found your favorite game? That is how I found my favorite game. <laughs> so the staff picks definitely work. Fresh, assumedly uh, those are uh, some newer titles as well. Faves, and I'm assuming this would be favorites from the rest of the community. Yes, because you can, you can like uh, certain games. More games are coming to the Ouya. Or is it just Ouya? Ah, you don't like listening to the story? <laughs> Well, I've, I've booted into the game so many times, like, I, I know it from remembering. Quite alright. We're just gonna experience gameplay on the Ouya game console. I said in previous videos, all of their games are pretty much free to play. So, uh, in this one they give you, uh, I think, two or three levels before you can go in to buy um, and expand. So this is the first level of this game, it's called uh, Vector, which is uh, a side-scrolling game where you're trying to escape uh, I like it because it's, it's it's easy, like a lot of their games are. Ah, oh, very parkour. Wow, very smooth. Really good frame rate, guys. Gameplay is as smooth as you could expect on a console, and it's only 99 bucks. That's the Ouya. Yeah. 